Police want your help tonight to track down two people that used a power saw on a Wells Fargo ATM machine early this morning. Yeah, what those crooks didn't know was that someone was videotaping everything while they were calling police. Our Wayne Haverly talked with a couple who took the video. He joins us live from the scene of the crime near 122nd and Airport Way. Real interesting here, Wayne. Yeah, no doubt about it, Jeff. Uh, all this went down about 3 a.m. this morning, and it looked like these uh, these criminals knew exactly what they were doing when they were cutting into that ATM machine behind me. But like you said, what they didn't know is that somebody was hiding behind those bushes that you see over there. And you know what they had? They had smartphones. Sparks fly as two bandits fire up a saw and start cutting into a Wells Fargo ATM machine. One of the crooks drove this old RV and apparently used it to shield their crime from traffic on 122nd Avenue. But what they didn't know was that Dan Higginson and Deidre Stone were inside their car searching for a Wi-Fi signal only 25 feet away, and they saw everything. It was just like, whoa, someone that actually has is so bold enough to actually go through and do this. Stone started taking video while Higginson called 911. You must have been a little worried that they'd see you. Well, I, I was at first. That's why I kept most of me behind the bush and just held it up. But I looked at them and their heads were covered so well, I knew that their field of vision wouldn't be real good. After about four minutes, the ATM bandits apparently spotted responding police and took off. One in the RV, the other on a motorcycle. I kept saying on the video, they need to hurry up and get here. <laughs> the two witnesses say police arrived about 40 seconds after the two criminals fled. A short time later, police say they discovered the RV and this warm saw ditched on the side of the road less than a mile from the scene along Aaron Way. The bandits didn't get the money, but you can see for yourself, it appears they were close. Looks like uh, there's just like a he knew exactly where to cut. Less than an inch left. He right? knew, yeah, he knew exactly where to cut. They're probably seconds away from getting in there. Yeah. Really messed up that people have to go through and do things like that. Yeah, some pretty wild uh, videotape there, or uh, not videotape, <laughs> just video, obviously. Uh, but anyway, I checked with Wells Fargo to see if there was any reward in this case. They told me that uh, they are not offering a reward at this time, but they're working closely with Portland police. So if you recognize anything you saw in that video, <laughs> you should call Portland police right away. Back to you guys. Yeah. You know